Materials are the building blocks of the objects we encounter every day. From the chairs we sit on, the cups we drink from, to the shoes we wear, they're all constructed from a variety of materials. Common materials include metal, wood, glass, plastic, ceramics, fabric, and rubber. In this video series, we'll take a closer look at each material, where they come from, their general properties, and their uses. Let's take a closer look at ceramics. Ceramics are materials made from natural substances like clay. Clay occurs naturally in the Earth's crust, resulting from the breakdown of igneous rock over millions of years. As minerals in the rocks break down, they create a fine-grained, malleable material, which, when mixed with water, can be moulded into various shapes. When clay is shaped and then heated to high temperatures in a special oven called a kiln, it hardens into ceramic. The high heat transforms the soft clay into a hard, often brittle material that can vary from porous to dense, depending on the type of clay and the temperature it's fired at. Ceramics are appreciated for their durability and heat resistance. That's why they're commonly used for pots, dishes and tiles. Unlike metals, ceramics don't rust or corrode, making them ideal for long-lasting uses. They can also withstand high temperatures without melting, which is why you'll find ceramic items in both kitchens and scientific labs. Furthermore, ceramics can be decorated with various glazes and designs, leading to beautiful plates, mugs and vases. Over time, advancements in ceramic technology have given rise to special types of ceramics with unique properties. For example, certain ceramics are designed to be super hard and are used in items like armour. Others, such as those used in heat shields of spacecraft, can withstand extreme temperatures, protecting the craft and its occupants during re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere. So from floor coverings and everyday plates and bowls to advanced space applications, ceramics play a pivotal role in our world. Thanks for learning. Check out the other videos in this series to learn about the origin, properties and uses of some other common materials. Bye for now. Don't forget to subscribe!